March 6th, the Cavs, they went 7-11 and 11 down the stretch. So I think that this begs for a cheat sheet, Miss Chine. What Let's do you got? Get it. Let's Biggest get it. screen in the house. Hey, guys, uh, do you want to join me? Do you want to have some fun with me? You want to improvise a me? little bit? No, Come on, I got the well. fellas in the building. <laughs> And y'all know it's win or go home time to make the playoffs, right, Malika? And the availability of players can really determine a team's playoff fate, especially today after Woj disrupted all of our mornings. Now, in the Hawks Cavs <laughs> matchup, this game may come down to whether Jared Allen plays or not. And here's why, fellas. Here are the numbers, right? Before Allen's injury, the Cavs were one of the best defensive teams in the NBA, fourth best to be exact. Now, after the injury, they have dropped quick to 22nd ranked defense out of 30 teams, which is not good at all and not their identity. And here's why having him on the court is absolutely crucial to the Cavs. So y'all want to say it with me? Roll me my tape, producer. Waiku, baby! Waiku, baby! <laughs> Roll the tape. Okay, look, this, look, look at the defense here. Watch his eyes on the ball. What do you guys see here? I mean, he's able to guard two players with one possession. Look at the ping pong. Look at the move. And y'all are disappearing from me, but it's all good. Still able to go two for one. This man is 6'10 with a 7'5 wingspan, and that is the best case scenario for a coach. Have a player that can hold, you know, fill in the holes. Now, I want to throw in some offense here. Thank you, Kwaku, because watch his eyes again. He sees that the paint is open. This is a pick and roll with Garland, the old star. And instead, he wants to get to that open spot, so he slips really quickly with his vision, and he's a tremendous lob threat. Now, this is a very stark contrast in defense. Before you could play two on one, on this side, you got a poster, and look at the extension. 11.9 feet. That is beautiful. And, oh, I'm sorry. Y'all are really petty today. Y'all are really petty today, showing how the Cavs love their identity being defense. Being a lob threat is going to be pushing through a little adversity, especially for Allen, because he's still probably going to be experiencing soreness through his hand and his presence on the other end, you know, offensively is also invaluable. But catching that ball might be a question, but he's probably going to push through that. They're going up against, honestly, this is very important, the Cavs, a man who led the entire end NBA in total points and assists this season, a man by the name of Trey Young. Burr. Mm. So Jared Allen gives the Cavs their best shot at slowing down one of the hottest teams entering the play in the Atlanta Hawks. His availability is very important. And Malika, I know that uh, Cavs fans are hoping that Jared Allen is all in. Oh, I see. I see what you did there. Thank you for watching ESPN on YouTube. For live streaming sports and premium content, subscribe to ESPN+.